Recently, President Biden has presented the first picture to be shown freely from the James Webb Telescope, the biggest and generally strong at any point sent off into space. The tremendousness of the vast web has done everything except frustrate our quest for information in the field of astronomy. What's more, planetary examinations. It has constrained mankind to set up modern space telescopes and send tests to investigate the far-off heavenly peculiarity. In this pursuit, we have uncovered fresh, clear pictures of Proxima b and exoplanets moving in the gravitational hug of Proxima Centauri. Its revelation in 2016 opened new aspects in galactic investigation, and presently, the most clear picture of Proxima be delivered by the James Webb Telescope is here. It is nothing to joke about. Colossal. Stay with us to see the reason why it is important. So much. Proxima Centauri is the nearest known star to the Sun and was found in 1915 by the Scottish space expert Robert Innes. He recognized this red small star as the nearest individual from the Alpha Centauri star framework. A century after the fact, in 2016, a worldwide group of space experts drove by Gian Onglat Escu found Proxima b, a heavenly body circling Proxima Centauri arranged inside the livable zone of its star. This exoplanet ignited excitement on its disclosure, promising an expected impression into the cosmology of tenable universes beyond our nearby planet group. Unveiled through the focal point of the James Webb Space Telescope, the significance of Proxima b reaches out a long way beyond its divine presence offering an enticing opportunity to investigate the mysteries of far-off universes. The discovery of Proxima b was a turning point in astronomy. Notwithstanding its closeness, technological restrictions had blocked definite investigation until the new advancement. Outfitted with cutting-edge imaging and spectroscopic tools, the James Webb Space Telescope has now offered astronomers the very first direct picture of this world-sized exoplanet. The picture is nothing to joke about, it has not just extended how we might interpret adjoining divine bodies, but also ignited significant ramifications for scientific investigation beyond our solar system. This picture represents an essential accomplishment, offering a visual understanding into an exoplanet dwelling inside the livable zone of a nearby star. This advancement has fueled energy within mainstream researchers, restoring the quest to fathom the potential tenability of exoplanets and explore the proclivities of life beyond our nearby planet group. So, how was the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, ready to help us here? Situated at the second Lagrange point or L2, approximately 1.5 million kilometers or around 1 million miles from Earth, the JWST is the apex of our space age developments. This location permits it to keep a steady orbit relative to our planet as it revolves around the sun equipped with a variety of cutting-edge scientific instruments. The JWST can capture images and collect data across different frequencies, especially in the infrared range. Its primary mirror is composed of 18 hexagonal segments and has a diameter of 6.5 meters or 21 feet. This is considerably larger than those of its predecessors. To image exoplanets like Proxima b, the JWST uses its near-infrared camera, NIRCAM, and near-infrared spectrograph, NIRSpec, among other instruments. The NIRCAM is vital for imaging and detecting objects in the near-infrared range, while NIRSpec performs spectroscopy to analyze the chemical structure, temperature, and other properties of heavenly bodies. Given Proxima b's distance from Earth and the challenges of observing exoplanets, the JWST's capabilities are essential. Its infrared sensitivity allows it to detect the faint infrared light emitted by Proxima b, which is crucial for characterizing the planet, focusing on its climate, and possibly identifying signs of habitability. The telescope's high resolution and sensitivity enable it to gather detailed information about exoplanets like Proxima b, significantly contributing to how we might interpret these far-off worlds. Coming the JWST was preceded by the Hubble Space Telescope, HST which stands as an icon in space exploration. Sent off in 1990, the HST marked a huge jump in our understanding and comprehension of the universe. Its process traces back to the space race era of the 1950s and 1960s, a period characterized by intense competition between the U.S. and the Soviet Union. This contention extended beyond international conflicts and into the domains of science and technology, culminating in competitive space programs. The origins of the Hubble can be traced to the aftermath of the space race as space agencies sought to transcend the limits of Earth's atmosphere, 
which distorts and obstructs much of the incoming light from heavenly objects. NASA's response to the problem was simple. They envisioned a space-based observatory that would bypass these atmospheric limitations and provide exceptional clarity and accuracy in cosmic observations. However, upon its send-off, a flaw in the Hubble's primary mirror compromised its initial capabilities. The mirror suffered from spherical aberration, making images appear blurred. This diminished the telescope's effectiveness significantly and led to a substantial re-evaluation of the project and necessitated a groundbreaking repair mission in 1993, where astronauts installed corrective optics to fix the mirror's flaw. Despite this early setback, the Hubble continued to revolutionize our understanding of the universe. It conducted extensive surveys, including the Hubble Deep Field and the Ultra Deep Field, capturing images of incredibly distant galaxies and shedding light on the early universe's evolution. The HST also provided detailed images of planets within our nearby planet group, allowing scientists to study their atmospheres, weather conditions, and moons. The Hubble also observed celestial birth processes and deaths, unveiling the complex details of star-forming regions and planetary nebulae. Its observations contributed to measuring the rate of expansion of the universe, leading to the discovery of dark energy, a mysterious force driving the universe's accelerated expansion. However, while revolutionary, the Hubble had limitations. Its instruments, although groundbreaking at the time, relied on technology from the 1970s and 1980s. Additionally, its location in low Earth orbit didn't shield it completely from the planet's atmospheric disturbances. Naturally, the need for a replacement, the James Webb Space Telescope, originated from the desire to overcome these limitations. The JWST was designed with larger and more advanced instruments specifically optimized for infrared observations, enabling it to peer further into space, study the earliest galaxies, and characterize exoplanets in ways the Hubble simply couldn't. The JWST thus represents a new era in space exploration, building upon the legacy of the Hubble while pushing the boundaries of how we might interpret the universe. The JWST has provided us exceptional clarity in cosmology and the study of exoplanets like Proxima b. Proxima b's orbit around its parent star, Proxima Centauri, is a captivating aspect of its characteristics. Despite the relative nearness to the red dwarf star, this exoplanet exists within the habitable zone, a region where conditions may allow for the existence of liquid water. Its location in this zone doesn't mirror Earth's. However, Proxima b receives a significantly different energy intake compared to our planet. This variation in energy intake strongly impacts its atmosphere, surface conditions, and overall habitability. The potential effects of this energy variance, whether it leads to extreme temperature fluctuations or unique atmospheric structures, present intriguing avenues for further research and understanding. Proxima b lives within tempting reach at just 4.2 light years away. Despite being Earth-sized and potentially habitable, it remained elusive because no telescope, ground-based or in space, has the capability to photograph this directly. Far off world. The JWST is designed precisely for infrared observations and thus doesn't need to capture visually the planet. Instead, it focused on specific infrared frequencies, tracking the variability of Proxima b as it circled. This is a promising research area, and we have taken many bold steps since the exoplanet's discovery in 2016. What truly distinguishes Proxima b is its short orbital period. The exoplanet completes a full revolution around Proxima Centauri in a mere 11.2 Earth days. This brief year raises compelling questions about the climate and the potential habitability of the planet. Such a fast orbit suggests that Proxima b likely experiences gravitational and tidal forces entirely different from what we observe and feel here on Earth. These differences can shape its geology, weather conditions, and potential for retaining an atmosphere. Obviously, there's much we need to learn about the planet. But how could we find it in the first place? Embracing the complexities of this neighboring exoplanet holds the promise of revealing insights into the broader questions of habitability and the prevalence of life beyond our solar system. Proxima b's location in its star's habitable zone has excited scientists, pointing to conditions conducive for liquid water, vital for life, despite challenges posed by its proximity to its star, including intense radiation. Recent JWST data suggests the presence of water vapor on the planet, 
a significant fact for habitability. Spectroscopic analysis offers insights into its atmosphere's structure, assisting in the search for life-supporting elements like oxygen and methane. These tools, combined with advanced atmospheric modeling, offer glimpses into the planet's atmospheric conditions and help us formulate hypotheses regarding its habitability. Further advancements in observational techniques and modeling will be instrumental in unraveling the mysteries of Proxima B's potential to harbor life. Yet, the possibility of extraterrestrial life on the planet, despite the challenges presented by the proximity of its star, is indeed worth entertaining. After all, we do have real-world examples of life thriving in such challenges even back here on Earth. Extremophiles are fantastic microorganisms that push the limits of where life can exist. They flourish in some of the most extreme conditions on Earth, places that were once thought inhospitable, like boiling hot springs, deep-sea hydrothermal vents, acidic lakes, or freezing Antarctic ice. They have opened up new possibilities for where life could exist. That's right, beyond our planet, suggesting conditions previously considered dreadful could support life. Much like the extreme circumstances on Proxima B may be home to extremophiles, Earth has a diverse array of extremophiles, showcasing life's adaptability to extreme circumstances. Among them, we have thermophiles that thrive in high temperature conditions, like Thermus aquaticus, a bacterium thriving in hot springs, and Pyrococcus, found in deep sea hydrothermal vents, where temperatures exceed 100 degrees Celsius. Psychrophiles, on the other hand, thrive in freezing temperatures. For example, Psychrobacter arcticus can survive in cold Antarctic conditions. Similarly, acidophiles like Acidithiobacillus ferrooxidans flourish in highly acidic conditions, while alkalophiles, such as Nomonas flavis, survive in highly basic environments. Lastly, halophiles like Halobacterium salinarum live in highly saline conditions like salt pans, demonstrating resilience to extreme salt concentrations. Considering the potential conditions on Proxima b, where extreme radiation due to proximity to its star may be a challenge, organisms like extremophiles on Earth might be able to adapt and perhaps even flourish. Deinococcus radiodurans, for example, boasts resistance to ionizing radiation, surviving doses thousands of times higher than what would be lethal to humans. Extremophiles have evolved various adaptation strategies, including DNA repair mechanisms, protective pigments, and unique cell structures. These adaptations suggest potential survival mechanisms that life forms on Proxima b could develop to thrive in its harsh conditions. Finding extremophile-like organisms on Proxima b capable of enduring extreme radiation or other harsh environmental factors would indeed change our understanding of life's adaptability beyond Earth. It could redefine the limits of habitability and expand the scope of exobiology, showing that life may thrive in seemingly inhospitable extraterrestrial conditions. But this is easier said than done. Exploring Proxima b and other distant exoplanets presents significant technological barriers. Currently, we are facing limitations in directly observing and characterizing distant celestial bodies. While telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope offer valuable insights, they have constraints in capturing detailed images or conducting close-up examination due to vast distances and the limitations of available technology. Overcoming these barriers requires advancements in telescope design, sensor technology, and perhaps even the development of revolutionary propulsion systems to enable interstellar missions. Future advancements for interstellar missions could revolutionize our capability to explore and understand exoplanets like Proxima b. Concepts including advanced propulsion systems like solar sail ion drives or even theoretical concepts like warp drives are under study now. These advancements aim to significantly reduce travel time to distant star systems, enabling closer observations and possibly even direct examination of exoplanets. However, as of yet, these concepts are largely theoretical and require extensive technological work before becoming feasible for interstellar traveling. The study of Proxima b is critical for advancing our understanding of exoplanets and the potential for life beyond Earth. Studying this exoplanet and others within its habitable zone contributes essential data to refine how we might interpret planetary formation, habitability conditions, and the prevalence of life-supporting conditions in the universe. Such data is crucial for future space exploration missions, 
guiding the selection of targets for further examination and eventual human colonization efforts. Proxima B is like a stepping stone toward unraveling the mysteries of distant worlds and expanding the horizon of our understanding of the universe. The study of exoplanets extends beyond Proxima B. Exoplanets are categorized into various classes, including gas giants like hot Jupiters, rocky planets resembling Earth or Mars, and intriguing substances like super-Earths, each holding unique characteristics and potential for supporting different circumstances for life. Advancements in exoplanetary research through telescopes like Kepler and the JWST have revealed the vast diversity of planetary systems in the universe, offering insights into exoplanet formation and potential habitability. These observations, including recent insights from the JWST's advanced capabilities, continue to shape how we might interpret exoplanets and guide future exploratory efforts. The JWST's groundbreaking discoveries extend beyond our nearby cosmic neighborhood. With recent observations including the discovery of distant galaxies and the study of cosmic phenomena like star formation and black hole behavior, its broad gaze has expanded our understanding of the early universe and opened new avenues of inquiry, fostering a deeper appreciation of cosmic complexity. The anticipated contributions from the JWST pledge to revolutionize future cosmic research. With high-resolution imaging and infrared sensitivity able to unveil the origins of worlds and further illuminate the circumstances for life's development. Furthermore, the possibility of encountering extraterrestrial life, potentially confirmed by discoveries like Proxima b, holds significant ramifications for how humanity might interpret life's presence and diversity in the universe, reshaping our perspective on our cosmic place. Finding life on Proxima b would drive advancements in various scientific fields like astrobiology and cosmology, prompting philosophical reflections about our cosmic place and ethical considerations. This mission could unite humanity, transcend cultural narratives, and fuel innovation in communication and technology, while fostering global cooperation. It raises ethical dilemmas but signifies a grand transformation in human understanding, propelled by instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, marking a new era of monumental exploration and reshaping our appreciation of the universe.